My name is Benedict Cumberbatch and this is my cultural life for Harper's Bazaar. What's your favourite cliche? You can't take it with you when you go. Poem known by heart? Uh, love song of J. Alfred Prufrock and Ode to a Nightingale. What would you say your guilty pleasure is? I've got a sweet tooth, so Bonoffi Pie ranks quite highly. What was the first record that you bought? Now 24. And the book that changed your life? Catch on the Right. What's your audition piece? It was Ricky Roma, Glenn Gary, Glenn Ross, and it was Oh, What a Rogue and Peasant Slave Am I from Hamlet, if you have to hear classical and new modern. Favourite, all time favourite film is very hard, but I might go with Betty Draper and say Singing in the Rain, but there are lots of others Wings of Desire for the Vendors, um, the Bicycle Thieves. And your favourite villain? Well, I, I saw it again recently, and I, I think Heath Ledger's Joker is utterly original. Who would you like to play you in a film? Christopher Walken would be, it would be very funny to see what he would do to me. Your favourite hour of the day? Uh, dusk and dawn, transition hours, the magic hours where night changes. Do you have any irrational fears? No, I'm quite a rationalist. I'm not superstitious. I think life is, uh, life is too full of uh, natural wonders and, and logical um, complexities to worry about illogical things. A recurring dream? Being abandoned in my grandmother's house on my own and waking up to find everyone's gone. <laughs> so speaks a child who went to boarding school. Abandonment issues, I think that's better. Anyway, I forgive you, Mum and Dad, that's fine. What's worth fighting for? An awful lot. Your name, your privacy, your uh, family. Certain parts sometimes as an actor I think are worth waiting for in a sort of metaphorical way. What's your signature dance? Wow. Um, the running man sometimes pops up. That's definitely not my signature. <laughs> That's when I don't know what's good for me. What's your USP? Uh, being able to fart on cue. That's impressive. Thank you. Oh, I didn't mean to say that one. <laughs> Money or sex? Oh. <laughs> sex. Apollo or Dionysus? Dionysus. Good cop or bad cop? Bad cop. Dylan or Hendrix? Pass. James Dean or James Stewart? Oh, no. That is, the, you are, you are digging deep into my soul of split personality, uh, both. Optimist or pessimist? Optimist. Minimalist or maximalist? Minimalist. Grace Kelly or Grace Jones? Grace Kelly. Lennon or McCartney? Lennon. Sorry, Paul. And my final question is, what's your fancy dress? My fancy dress is a sort of um, Snoop Doggy style um, 50s pimp thing going on. I bet you wear it well. Thank I you. I do, I do. Be known to come out of weddings. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. My pleasure.